Come in. Come in. <laughs> yeah, like, I just wanted to know if uh, it was cool if I hung out here for a little bit, you know? Why, of course you can. All right, cool. Uh, do you mind if I put on some music? Absolutely, Vincent. Vincent. <laughs> Vincent. <laughs> <laughs> I know all about you, Vincent. Oh yeah? Like what? You are the one. <laughs> Whoa, jeez. I don't even know what to say about that. <laughs> I'm really excited. You're going to have to do better. <laughs> okay. The things you come up with are going to have to be a lot better than the things we're used to. Whoa, I mean, like, what do you mean? I, I'm, I'm I really... I mean, you cannot no. possibly do anything that has to do with Scientology. Whoa, like, what? Why would you say that? My, I got chills. They're multiplying. It. It's been done before. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it has dude. happened before, and it had happened again. The one comes along. Uh -huh. He pretends to be a savior. Uh -huh. We let him pass, and he spills his mind of Scientological things. Wow. <laughs> you cannot possibly change this. It is the way it has been. It is the way it shall always be. Okay. You are no different at all. all right. You think you are unique, but you are not. Okay. I am a man in a gray suit in a room that is white with videos with pictures of you. But hey. Check out those pictures. They might be yelling at you. Wait, wait, wait. They're yelling at you. Okay. Your own pictures you are yelling at you. It'd be a lot easier to listen to you if you used a big word like apropos. <laughs> that would not be apropos. Oh, you smart, you. Look at this guy. You have a question to make. Yeah, I do. And an answer to put into action. Yeah, I totally do. Will you save your lover? Hey! Hey! What? Will you save your lover? I mean, he's fine. He's on the screens, you know. Not you! Oh. Her. <laughs> what, what? I touched my pen. I saw that. <laughs> what, you mean that one pen? Yes, you can save her or you can just walk away. I don't know if you uh, realize this, but uh, I, it's a woman. You watch too many movies, you know? I, I don't like the girls, you know what I'm saying? Just... <laughs> <laughs> you see my role choices, you know? I'm wearing, I got suspenders on and I got angels on my... You know, on my back, and I'm not sleeping with any of the women in the house. You see, that one? I mean, come on. I've <laughs> never seen a widow's peak so distracting. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> see, no, I did this at home, too. I just took some scissors and cut a big chunk out and pulled you them You make me want to right overdose here. on blue pills. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'm the one who took the blue pills in the first place, and I still ended up here, you know? I mean, it's crazy. I think it was all that mescaline, you know what I'm saying? If you would have taken the red one, you would have fallen asleep and you would have woken up without any, you know, itchy and, you know, watery and, you know, snottiness and it's, it's an antihistamine, right? I always, always had a question, though. Do you really think that instead of Keanu get, falling into the Matrix that he just died and, or he got put in some sort of weird coma? We can talk about ethics and philosophy, or we could just listen to the Matrix commentaries on that special edition 9-disc DVD set. Which is available at Best Buy right now. It's got four different versions of audio commentary with uh, many philosophers, mm -hmm. the director, the actors. And it's and a great deal because you get so many hours of content. It is. It's so <laughs> great. You know, I just can't think of anything I would want to do more than watch The Matrix Revolution with commentary four times. And we have a special <laughs> deal for you because I had a little experiment at the house. I took Pulp Fiction and The Matrix movies and crammed them all in my DVD player. And what I saw was the most beautiful shit in the world. It's true. If you take the Matrix audio and play it over Pulp Fiction, it makes no sense. <laughs> <laughs> and if you put more than one disc in the, in the DVD player at once, it won't play. Shh. <laughs> 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 It might fuck up your DVD player. We've gone through three. I want to see if it'll happen a fourth time, but we might want to add another DVD in there, though. Or we could just stop trying to put the Matrix and Pulp Fiction together. There's got to be a way to make them just a one power pack viable movie. Not tonight, there's not. No, there's not. <laughs> That's the Matrix and Pulp Fiction. Yeah. <laughs> too many names, too much confusion. There's a lot of people in there. What's next? <laughs>